We're also very happy about the forecast, or at least I'll speak for myself. Sunny, cool, so really you can get into the fall spirit. And we've talked about it. You're happy because of the fall attire and yes. the fall activities. Exactly. So pumpkin patch, corn maize. Mm -hmm. Sipping some hot apple cider. Sweaters. Yes. Sweater, sweater weather. Sweater yeah. weather, boot weather. We got it all going on this weekend. So now is the time. Let's check in with our weather watchers here, keeping an eye on things. They have an eye on the numbers. They have some fabulous photos for us as well. So you can see kind of a range as far as those temperatures go. Very chilly start, particularly chilly for those of us waking up in the 30s here. Barbara and Wayne Case Camp, our good friends in Bel Air here. Good morning. Let's start the day. Beautiful kitty. And then Raven's great Ray Lewis. Love, we're all about the Ravens today. It's not just a purple Friday or a game day, it's just a purple week, purple way of life. Linda in Edgewood, Maryland. Beautiful shot of the deer there. Twyla, gorgeous fall colors on the trees. We love that one. And then Raven's Purple, more of that from George and from Janet in Tawny Town. So thank you so much. Okay, the temperatures here on our map, you can see 42 right now at BWI, 50 for our friends in Annapolis, 51 in Westminster, 50 in Frederick. A little bit of perspective from where we were yesterday. So we're now 19 degrees colder than at this point on Friday, 22 degrees colder in Frederick. So Yesterday, you may recall the gray, the rain, so we started off in the 60s and then temperatures fell throughout the day. Northwest winds, so we're pulling in that cooler and drier air. As we take a look at the future cast, you'll notice, yes, indeed, the time stamp moving forward, but I have zero changes to tell you about until late tomorrow afternoon when it does look like we see some clouds moving in, but I'm still going with mostly sunny for tomorrow. Here we are today, this high of 62 degrees. For the most part, clear skies. Certainly is going to be cool. Yesterday, the high was 66, but remember, that was in the morning. And then tonight, we're going to dip down into the upper 30s. So tonight is going to be a chilly night. So make sure you are bundled up if you're going to be out and about here. As we look ahead to later this weekend, 66 for tomorrow, and then the 70s making a comeback for the work week. So I do love some 70s, don't get me wrong, especially when they're accompanied by nice doses of sunshine.